Imagine what it was like to be here on November 14th, 1951. The grand opening of Pembroke Memorial Centre, with the Montreal Canadiens in town to christen the new building in an exhibition game with the Pembroke Senior Lumber Kings. Rocket Richard, Boom Boom Jeffrion, Elmer Lack, all the big stars were here. So was the Pembroke Peach, the great Frank Nyber, who would receive his Hall of Fame scroll in a pre-game ceremony at Centre Ice. NHL President Clarence Campbell dropped the ceremonial puck between the Lumber Kings' Jack Carthy and the Canadians' Ken Mosdell. The Habs won 6-4, and the PMC had its first of many historical moments. Imagine what it was like to be here on that historic night. History, that's what the 70th anniversary of the PMC is all about. It's a walk through the hallways where so many great players made their way onto the ice of this fabled hockey auditorium. The Giesebricks, Cully and Thane Simon, Larry Mick, Pat Hahn, Tim Young, Luke Shabbat, Peter White, Dinah Subras, Matthew Pekka, Ben Reinhardt, Mason McTavish, and the list goes on. On its walls and in its rafters is the story of Pembroke's rich hockey history, the triumphs and the tragedies the names that brought Pembroke the attention of the nation and made it Hockey Town Canada. The great Bill Kutchke brought the excitement of those early years to hockey fans throughout the Ottawa Valley. Through his radio broadcasts, he contributed to the mystique of the PMC. But so did characters like Art Bogart, who for decades built winning senior and junior Lumber King teams. Imagine what Bogey would have thought about the PMC celebrating its 70th anniversary and the bar that carries his name. The PMC has been a starting point for so many careers that led to the top hockey leagues in the world. Coaches like Brian Murray and Sheldon Keith got their start here. Others left their mark at the junior level. Great Lumber King coaches like Mac McLean and Jim Farrelly still remain front and center in any conversation about the many championships that have been won by the Junior Lumber Kings. It's been seven decades, memories baked into the original wooden seats that have held thousands of people for concerts, graduation ceremonies, political conventions, vaccination clinics, skating shows, and of course, hockey games. The PMC has lived up to its expectation of being a community center but it knows its place and what it stands for. They shall not grow old, as we that are left grow old. Age shall not weary them, nor the years condemn. At the going down of the sun and in the morning, we will remember them, lest we forget why this building was built. The Pembroke Memorial Center will forever be a memorial to those who made the eternal sacrifice for our country lest we forget.